Hello friends. Based on our previous lessons, we now understand how spherical mirror generates image of an object after reflection when object is placed at different positions in front of the mirror. But it would be quite inconvenient if you have to imagine the whole ray diagram whenever you are asked where the image would form for a certain position of the object. Right? Let's find a formula to help us find the position of the image. Let u is equal to distance between object and pole of the mirror. This is called object distance. v be the distance between image formed and pole of mirror. This is the image distance. And f is the focal length of the mirror. So the formula is 1 by u plus 1 by v is equal to 1 by f. But remember one thing in this formula. In case of spherical mirrors, all distances are measured from pole. Imagine pole as the origin of a Cartesian graph. That is pole P is 0, 0. All the distances measured in direction of incident ray from pole are positive and the opposite direction is negative. That is anything measured on the left of the pole P is negative and anything on the right of the pole P is positive. Same way if any length is measured upward from principal axis gets positive sign like the positive height and if any length is measured downward from principal axis it gets negative sign. In case of convex mirror we always get virtual upright image on the opposite side of the object. So U which is the object distance has negative sign as it is left of P whereas F the focal length and V the image distance are positive as it is right of P. But in case of concave mirror in most cases we get real inverted image on the same side of the object. So U and V has negative signs as those are measured in the opposite direction of incident ray from the pole and F is also negative here. So U, V and F are negative in concave mirror in most of the cases. Only in case of object placed too close to the concave mirror, it produces an upright virtual image. In that case, V will be positive. And how do you find the size of the image formed? Let H be the height of the object. H dash be the height of the image formed and m be the magnification of the image. Then m is equal to height of the image formed h dash divided by height of the object h. And it is also equal to minus times image distance v divided by object distance u. So m is equal to h dash by h is equal to minus v by u. Height of the object H is positive as it is placed above the principal axis. Height of the image formed H dash will be positive for virtual erect image as image formed is above principal axis. And height of image formed H dash will be negative for real inverted image as image formed is below principal axis. So M is positive means a virtual image and negative means a real image. Bye-bye.